Hello, I'm Mitzi Stover, and today I'm going to show you how to resolve some common MLA format errors that I come across pretty frequently in student writing. So let's get started. First of all, I'm looking at the first page of a document in MLA format, and I can already see before I start to read it that there are some formatting issues that can easily be cleaned up. So let's see what they are. First off, you'll notice the header. The header should have your last name followed by a space and then the page number. In this case, the header looks correct, except that the font doesn't match the remainder of the document. This is usually because your default font is set to Arial 11. So what we'll need to do is go into the header and adjust the font to match the rest of the doc document. Typically, you're going to be using Times New Roman 12 point font. So just make sure it matches in the header. The next error that we'll see comes over here with the heading. The heading should be double spaced, just like the rest of the document. In this case, it's single spaced. So I need to go in and highlight the heading and then change it to double spaced. The next error that I spot is the date. The date looks correct, except that in MLA format, it should be written like this. So instead of January 23rd, 2020, it should be 23 space January 2020. Notice there's no commas in the date when it's written like this. The next error that I spot has to do with the title. The title is centered as it should be, and it follows the heading, but the font is too large. So your font of your title should be 12 point font, just like the rest of the document. It shouldn't be in bold. It shouldn't be underlined or italicized, just straight 12 point font. And the last error I see on this page has to do with this extra spacing here between the title and the first paragraph. There's no need to put an extra space between the title and the first paragraph. In fact, it's not what you should be doing in MLA, so remove all of those extra line spaces. The last error that I typically see on the first page of a document frequently also has to do with line spacing, and this generally happens when your default settings um, add in an extra line after paragraphs. So you'll see here that the line spacing is not consistent throughout the document. The header, heading has extra spaces between the lines. There's an extra space between the last line of the heading and the title. And there's also an extra space between paragraphs. It should all be double space, all consistent. So what's happening here is that there is an extra space being added after each paragraph. So to correct this, if you're using Google Docs, You'll go into your document, be sure to highlight the entire document first so that the changes take effect throughout. So control A will highlight the whole document. And then if you go up to the line spacing button on the toolbar, click it and you'll see if you go down to near the bottom where it says remove space after paragraph, if you click that, it should remove all the extra spaces and then your document will look like this and you'll be good to go. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.